there's another uh, factor that is going to come uh, uh, later this month, early, early early next month, with with the UNHRC coming back uh, with all its guns blazing against Sri Lanka. Um, it was gone for about four five years. I think uh, now it's back again because the United States is also back in the in the UNHRC. Um, what do you think uh, we may have to do this time? Do we think we have to do something different this time around? Because uh, I think we may have to change the tactic. Uh, always going with the mentality of you know trying to fight them is hasn't worked for us. Uh, maybe talk to them and try to win them over would be the best approach. What do you, what do you think, Chandra? <laughs> Actually, uh, once again, it has to be properly strategized. And previously, this is again, again, we did not have uh, a proper continuity or consistency in our uh, policies from the government of Sri Lanka side. As a result, we have faced all these troubles. At the initial stage, actually, as a soldier we have been fighting, I am sure that <clears throat> we don't have, uh, we have enough and more materials to mm -hmm. defend all these things. And these allegations are very false allegations and baseless allegations. Of course. We have enough facts to prove that these allegations are wrong, baseless. So we have to answer these questions the way that they are trying to make allegations. We have to answer this with facts and figures. We have to answer this with uh, proper... Uh, rate. We actually, we went to Geneva and challenge those people. If you want, you come to Sri Lanka. Sri Lanka is a free country. Nobody is restricted to move around. You can come and talk to those people who got involved and say and there are hundreds of people were killed. Like uh, when these people came out, there were 1,600 uh, United Nations related organization workers within this group which came. Not even a stretch to those people. Here yeah, we know that we have uh, facts and figures. So we it have is the real facts and figures. Real facts and figures. And releasing these facts and figures through the military or the intelligence side yes, won't right. work. It must be by uh, the other people, sources. Uh, other sources. So likewise, this is it. I mean, very beyond the normal traditional system I am talking. But mm, on the other thing also, I am sure this government is quite capable. His Excellency is yes. very much aware. I have very uh, my uh, trust uh, on the government. They will definitely talk to these people and handle this. Um, uh, the foreign ministry also. We have uh, people yeah. who are um, very confident, the secretary and the minister. So um, I'm sure this time round we will be able to handle it, uh, even though uh, it's a serious problem.